Hello. So today we are going to learn about mathematics class seven chapter fourteen symmetry. Glossary. These are the main words in this chapter. Symmetry, the quality of being made up of exactly similar parts facing each other around an axis. Line symmetry. The line symmetry is also called a mirror line because it represents two reflections of an image that concoid. Therefore, it is also a type of reflection symmetry. Line of symmetry. The line of symmetry can be defined as the axis or imaginary line that passes through the center of the shape or object and divides it into two identical halves. Reflection symmetry. Reflective symmetry is when a shape or pattern is reflected in a line of symmetry or a mirror line. Polygon, a plane figure with at least three side stripes and angles and typically five or more. Or of rotational symmetry, the number of positions in which a figure can be rotated and still appears exactly as it did before the rotation is called the order of symmetry. Center of rotation, a point or line around which all other points in a body move is called the center of rotation. Introduction Symmetry is an important geometrical concept. It's commonly exhibited in architecture and nature. Line of symmetry means the line which divides the figure into two equal halves. Multiline of symmetry means having two or more lines in one figure. Line of symmetry for regular polygons. A regular hexagon has all its sides equal and each of its angles measure 120. The regular polygons are symmetrical figures and hence their lines of symmetry are quite interesting. Each regular polygon has as many lines of symmetry as it has sides. We say they have multiple lines of symmetry. Activity Exercise 14.1 this is the exercise 14.1 and this you can do this as an activity with a punching machine and a paper. Reflection and point symmetry. The line where a mirror can be kept so that one half appears as the reflection of the other is called the line of symmetry. Now in this figure, this is the mirror line, this is the original figure and this is the mirror image. A figure can have one or more lines of reflection symmetry. Point symmetry is when every part has a matching part. The same distance from the center point but in the opposite direction. This is the original figure. Here the mirror is kept and the same distance and it, uh, the way, a, way, a very easy way to understand this is now I'm having a figure here. I'm having another figure here and it touches in this point, right? So it is a point symmetry. When the mirror image and the, uh, the real image attaches together in a mirror, or a point, it is a yes, point symmetry. The same distance from the central point but in the opposite direction. This is the where we can keep this is the real image but opposite, but it is having central point, same distance, right? Rotational symmetry. If a figure is rotated around a center point and it still appears exactly as it did before the rotation, it is said to have rotational symmetry 
a number of shapes like square, circles, regular hexagon, etc. have rotational symmetry. Rotational symmetry, center of rotation. For a figure or object that has rotational symmetry, the fixed point around which the rotation occurs is called the center of rotation. Example, the center of rotation of a windmill in the center of the windmill from which its blade originate. Rotational symmetry angle of rotational symmetry for a figure or object that has rotational symmetry the angle of turning during rotation is called the angle of rotation example when a square is rotated by 90 degrees it appears the same after rotation so the angle of rotation for a square is 90 90 degrees Rotational symmetry, order of rotational symmetry. The number of positions in which a figure can be rotated and still appears exactly as it did before the rotation is called the order of symmetry. For example, a star can be rotated five times along its tip and look at the same every time. Hence, its order of symmetry, yeah, it's five. Some to do. First one, this is the figure given and the answer is 4. Now let's see how to do it. Now we are rotating it by 90 degrees. Let's rotate and we are getting the same. So 1, again rotating it by 90 degrees. Yes, the same again, again rotating. The same figure again, again 90 degrees we are rotating and the same figure we get it. and we get 4. What's the explanation? Let's see. We did this by rotating the shape by 90 degrees right and we got the same shape whenever we rotated it. So we can say that this shape has the order of rotational symmetry as 4 because we rotated it 4 times and we got the same shape. Examples of rotational symmetry. The recycle logo has an order of rotational symmetry of 3. The paper windmill has an order of rotational symmetry of 4. The triangle has an order of symmetry of 3. The swastik symbol has an order of rotational symmetry of 4. The roundabout road sign has an order of symmetry of 3. Line symmetry and rotational symmetry. The, there are some figures which have both rotational and line symmetry. For example, a square. It has four lines of symmetry and four order, order of rotational symmetry, right? And all the polygons, right? Conclusion. Symmetry is very important in our daily life and it's very interesting. Thank you.